Hey guys. Okay. I'm coming on and I'm doing another one real quick. I am not coming live right this second because my energy is all over the place. Um, oh, I just unplugged you and I didn't want to. I do want to talk about the fact that justice keeps coming out on the board. Okay. It's, it's talking about balance making decisions, fair, right, and just decisions. Um, to, to better your situation, okay? Um, whether you're going through a good time, a hard time, the depiction of the cards that in my justice, okay, because I have all different decks, the ones that have been coming out are, are pretty, pretty balanced. Um, some of that's not going to make any sense. Um, the scales and the pictures, the balance is here, if that makes sense. Okay. Um, it is, it is that time to do things. Follow your passion. You are ready for any challenge. Opportunities for excitement and adventure are here. Um, but this is also being brave, optimistic. Got the Ace of Pentacles, okay? So this is, this is I'm reading on why justice is coming out, okay? Because it's a positive, new emotional experience, fulfilling romantic relationships, deep and lasting insights, unconditional love, okay? Um, new starts, new adventure, new time. We got the Queen of Air, okay, and it is that Libra energy. You, but you know exactly what to do here, okay. Um, to me, it's screaming. To me, it's. <sighs> Some of you, you have the Ace of Pens too, along with the Ace of Cups. But you need to stand up for what you want and have the confidence to reclaim your personal power here. Um, <clears throat> You're going to have to make some pretty important decisions. This is not like light and easy, airy decisions for all of you. There's, there's no way. But the balance is here. It's time for a new experience. It's time for love. It's time for a new star. It's, it's time to feel that integrity that you have. Six of Michael, okay? So it's like the light at the end of a tunnel. Some of you are relocating or traveling, but this is a lesson learned. So because it was lesson learned, love, time, devotion, dedication, new adventure, all this is coming in. This is a beautiful, beautiful thing. Okay, I think a lot of people are, are thrown off with the justice right now. But it's, yeah, it's a karmic, yeah. Do I think some of you have... You could have Libra in your in, in your Saturn. Um, some of you are sad, but it is to have a new beginning. You know what I mean? Like to have a new outlook, new insight on something. Like Whatever's happening right now that's ending, that's sad or frustrating or intense, it's to have a brand new opportunity. It's here. To me, it was already given because you started. You learned a lesson. Whenever you learn a lesson, you move on to the next. But your, your new start is adventure. It's love. It's dedication. It's time. 
um, this happiness. It steps away from living out dreams. Um, some of you are just so confused with these options. Some of you are just so comfortable in the situation right now that it's... Okay. There's definitely a family dynamic here. And there's this pain attached to it. Like, letting go. So some of you have a family dynamic, but you have other options. And some of you don't want to break someone else's heart because in a way they're, they're kind of good to you. But the options are here to create new. This is not to manifest something new with this person. This is a chance at something brand new for some of you. Okay, like that came to its end. The Ten of Wands coming to an end. It could have been a third party or a marriage. But there's a connection here. Holding on to a relationship that's no longer there. It's not emotionally fulfilling. You know... No adventure. It, it's, it's, it's tough because I didn't want to tell this story, that story on the board. I just did a daily read that had different scenarios in it. Needless to say, this is why Saturn, Saturn's now direct, okay? Um, bottom of the deck. Taking a leap of faith if, if you're willing to. Saturn is here to bring in new opportunities, especially once you have learned a lesson and move forward. It really just depends where you're in, in in life, where you're at. Whether you're happy, you're sad, you don't know how to work with the energy. If you know you've learned a lesson and you know what you deserve and, and you know to go after happiness because happiness is what brings contentment. You can't be content. You can be comfortable, but you can't be content without happiness. That's comfortable. That just sounded ass backwards. Some of you knew exactly what I was saying right there. You need to have confidence in this situation to have this new start, this new opportunity. The opportunity that was already given there here. Something, it's like, as soon as someone completes a lesson. Tell me about this lesson. Okay. Okay. Hannah Gabriel. To nine of Wands, you gotta stay determined, you gotta move forward, you gotta be prepared, you gotta stay positive. Um, so you're, you're, learn, you're leaving a hard situation for those that are leaving. For those who are standing in their position and standing strong and you have an opportunity for a new situation ship with whatever Saturn's bringing in, You have a brand new start with a new emotional situation, ship, new resources. Could be a change of a job or a promotion. Fulfilling romantic relationships, deep, lasting spiritual insights. It's, it's positive. This doesn't just happen overnight. Okay. But, um,. Stay strong no matter what situation ship you're in. If you had to let something go, you have new. At the end of the day, if you're honestly doing what's best for you and not other people, Saturn, you're going to be able to reap the rewards of Saturn. This is that time period where rewards come in. It's, it's where the planets are aligned. It's... It's major, major life-changing energy for some. 
in, in a beautiful way. And, and what if there was a breakup? You, you don't see it as anything positive necessarily, right? As I say that, it says release the past. Because ultimately, I was just about to get to that because it is your decision, right? But say you, you ended a relationship and you don't see the good in it. Well, oh, you certainly will. Okay, but it's it's also your decision if you don't want to release the past. Someone's definitely outgrown a situation. Release yourself that holds you back. Okay? You're worried about your future because of lack of confidence for some of you. You know? But it's saying here you can be free. You gotta be conscious. You gotta make the conscious choice to change your situation. Okay. <laughs> New beginnings. All right, so it's just, what I'm trying to say is that no matter where you are, honest to God, listen to me. If you stand your ground and you choose happiness, not routine, not comfort, it's going to be different for everyone, right? Because a family dynamic just came out, so I can understand that too. It took me four years to get out of my marriage, you know. <sighs> You always have the choice, but this choice, your consequence, a new beginning, or or stay in your situation. Because you don't want to change your situation. Because if you stay in the same situation, nothing changes. Are you still comfortable? Yeah. Some of you. Or can you or do you really want to take a new adventure? I do you have an adventurous bone in your body? Do you do you like that type of Momentum. It really just depends on who you are, where you're at, what you're going to do. It seems like almost everyone with the energy has a chance for a new opportunity, so don't look at it as hardy, because some of you, it's definitely breakups to have something brand new. Some of you, it's third party, do I stay or do I take something brand new? And, and some of you are single, but you got brand new coming, because you just ended a lesson that was very important. So you mark my words, if you choose happy, like you're truly happy, you know what you deserve, you will not lose in the end. So I, I hope that helps a little bit, okay? Um, yeah, I just, I don't want to keep repeating myself. I, I just, somebody needed... For me to break down what this is about, okay? So, hope to help somebody. Love you, bye.